Okay, cool. What the? Uh, uh, huh? What? Oh, I didn't. I, I thought the close H would connect. Wait, what? Is that. Is Rock Smash projectile invo? Why did her DP lose there? It clashed? I guess. Yeah, the explosions must be projectiles. But I guess because they're both U skill projectiles, there's not like, yeah. It being like a, a DP projectile doesn't give it like extra. That was very strange. All right, folks, we are back for more Grand Blue Fantasy vs. Rising action for you here on the Road to Master with Swords. And we have Seika, who's on PlayStation because his PC died. Understandable, sir. Have a good day. So this is, uh, this is quite, uh, quite a tough match, honestly, to start my uh, my Sora's day with. But I guess we'll do what we can with what we have. Country girls, as I have been told, do their best to make do. And you know what? That helps, for sure. Oh, nice, nice. Tried to 2L on the way in. Didn't quite work out for me there. Ow. Ow. Can you say that my first rank stream was the one where Brick Reach Masters? I we'll see. We'll see. We're doing our best. Seika is a tough opponent, though. Is it like this is not like a master or smurf? Like it's like literally Seika is just like he is just like a Zeta. Like I mean, I think he has once again uh, dropped near for Zeta, but like like he is just like a Zeta main for real, who's just like happens to be playing an S plus plus right now. So this is uh, gonna be a tough a tough ask if I do say so myself. Oh baby, so true bestie. Six six M, understandable. Oh nice, the far H anti air right there. Rick isn't a city girl, but a country girl? Yeah, and that's why I, I must make do, is my understanding of things. Am I gonna get fuzzy? Don't do it to me. I don't know if he, if he's got if he got that, that tech, but I, I don't want to find out. Oh! Nice, nice. You parry is not gonna get memed out like uh, the H parry did by the multiple hits of Rock Smash, and my ass got counter hit for not fuzzy matching. That's on me. I really gotta start doing that, man. I just kinda like 2L with a with a with a hope in my heart, and uh, sometimes it works and sometimes I die. It's Really inconsistent. That's why you fuzzy bash to try and make it a little bit more consistent. Okay, minus two there, but you know, spaced out to the point where it's essentially not a factor. You can wait her out there and then blow that up. Oh, whoa, whoa, really? I, you know, sure. I did not expect wow, wow, wee, wow. I did not expect that to be how that went down. I am, unfortunately, unk. So these things happen. You wouldn't do like another use skill right away, would you, Seiko? Oh, nice staggers. Good shit. I'm not dead, am I? No. That's an interesting little combo route. That's not how I would expect him to, to route it, but it was how he routed it. Nice. A little bit of a delay before I uh, let my gorilla side uh, out. I'm still yet to hit someone with the uh, Eustace's fuzzy overhead, and I'm dying to get it. Eustace has a fuzzy? Howie. I don't know anything about this useless guy, man. It's crazy. For real, for real. Oh, nice. That sweep is fast, right? That's a. Uh, it's like the the Siegfried sweep and stuff. It's like oh, six frames or whatever, right? Only on specific characters, I guess. It's, it's height dependent, probably, right? Oh, nice. I tried to delay Rock Smash, but he mashed right away. Well, not right away, but pretty pretty soon after he woke up. When do we get to see Uno fuzzies in action? Not for me. I don't even even if I played him right now, I'd have no idea what the hell you're talking about. I don't even I don't even know that I didn't even know he had a fuzzy until you mentioned it just now. Oh! Drop! Hmm. He's not dead! Oh I could have maybe done regular I could have done regular dash punch. I could have done like EX dash punch. I didn't have the meter, but you can still get the regular dash punch. It's just obviously not as much reward. But yeah, if I had done EX dash punch right there, they would have died. So even I didn't have the meter for it, I definitely still should have done that. I didn't recognize it at the time, though. Yeah, so Swords' JM is the much easier to convert off of one, is my understanding. JH, you have to hit really low to actually convert off of, but JM does does just work a lot of the time. Check out these guns, Mr. Seika. Okay. Ow, ow. He was in throw range. I honestly did not expect that, but he was. I, I gotta stop uh, trying to block the high there. He hit me with a... I blocked it once, and then I, I've kind of been like, conditioned to look for it. That wasn't punishable, really. I mean, maybe I should have done... Uh, well, I, I hit my I hit my six framer. I don't know. Oh, nice. Okay. Honestly, that could be... Uh, worst things could have happened. For him reacting to my shit right there. Nice, nice. I definitely did get the preemptive brave counter habit going. And I've been punished for it accordingly. Arves for the setups. Yeah, the fake meaty. I had a feeling. You're not unk, are you, Seika? Oh, baby. He is. Uh, I messed up the combo. That is not the conversion, believe it or not. Oh, really? I didn't get the 2H out in time. Horrible news, if I do say so myself. 
Oh, nice. Nice. Lots of fumbles by me right there. I hit 2H fast enough on the knee. I dropped the combo on the Raging Strike. That was just, unfortunately, horrendous uh, as far as a technical execution level. But, you know, once again, country girls or something. Oh, once again, I keep trying to block the high, too, which is some silly behavior for me, for sure. Check out these guns, Mr. Sick. You know, he spent the Brave Point on that, honestly. That is, I would call that a, an absolute win for us. Even though he didn't really get much off of, like, you know, in, in theory, like, reacting to that spot dodge. I didn't. I just hit 5U anyway. But, yeah, he did He did just waste his one of his Brave Points on that, which is huge news for me. Oh, nice. Yeah, because now it means he's, like, damn near dead here? Maybe I could have killed him, actually, if I had dumped the other Raging Strike. Hard to say. Sure. That's good. Makes him a lot less scary in general. Yeah, he couldn't have done a second Arvest follow-up there. He was just gonna kill himself had he tried it. Oh! I tried you dash punch and I misinputted it. That's exactly why he couldn't have tried another one, right? Okay. Nope. Nope. Go away, sir. Yo, Steve. Thanks for the follow, man. Much appreciated. Hope you're, hope you're enjoying the content. I don't know if it's intentionally, but I love when Swords goes the spirit of Rock Smash. Yeah, yeah. The spirit of manhood, and he just interrupts himself. So I'm looking for games, dog. I uh, I'm I'm trying I'm trying to get my my sword is out of uh, out of hell right now. But uh, I'm definitely down to play you at some point. Are you still rocking the Belial? God knows I need uh, God knows I need that Belial experience. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Yeah. No, I'm down, dog. But yeah, like right now I'm just like I'm stuck in S plus plus, and I'm I've been stuck in S plus plus two with swords for like a fucking week. So I'm just I'm I'm out or like no like more. Like three weeks or something. So I'm just trying to I'm trying to I'm trying to climb out of hell here, but that will I'll keep that in mind. Simply punch them harder? I'm trying though. They keep parrying my ass. They keep dodging my punches. Turns out just doing this in neutral seven times in a row is not the way to get to master. I thought it would be. Everyone told me that this character was just you dash punch and win. I'm being lied to. So true, that's what I'm saying. Man. I've been I've been I've been led astray. Andre fuzzy, uh, fuzzy works on Zoe, so he might be cooked. So what is, what is the setup for the Uno Fuzzy? Because I know like like Zeta, for example, she needs a hard knockdown off of her Arvest, right? And then she hits you, she comes down with a little. Is it her JL? I can't remember. But okay, she hits you and then she you know she can instant high low you like that. But I also don't know if that one is character uh, specific either, right? I, I've only run into it playing Ladiva, so she's a tall character. I'm not sure if it could work otherwise. They do hard knockdown off Alt Spinny. Oh, okay, okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. The, like, Spiral Spear, right? Like, uh, hold on, hold on. Rare footage of Uno being on screen in Grand Blue Fantasy vs. Rising, but... We're talking about, you're talking about, uh... Oh, wait, hold on. This? No. No. I tried literally all of them. I tried the, all the wrong ones. This one? GG's, GG's, sir. GG's. You make it to Masters with less U dash punches and more EX moves? I got to Master pretty fast with them when I learned. Interesting. Less you dash punches, more EX moves. But have you considered that the dash punch like activates my neurons, and makes me feel good, Steve? Like it just it, it makes me it makes me happy when it hits. You don't care about my happiness? Yeah, so this this uh, it should make you happy, yes? Yeah, exactly. Wait, so this this hard knockdowns you're saying? Oh yeah, okay, I see, I see. Plus 62? What the hell? That's like too much. I guess you have to like frame kill this in some way, right? If you're gonna if you're gonna try and do some sort of setup, right? Because his his jump arc, yeah. Oh, he's got a little bit of a floaty one. Okay, so it's 48. But still, like that's that's like way too much, right? They two L to frame kill, yeah, yeah. So that's 18 frames. So it'd be mass 44. Oh yeah, that works out. Yeah, yeah. Especially with his his jump arc being uh, a little floatier, right? That is something that was really weird to me. That I'm glad that the the frame meter has uh, elucidated, right? Is that uh, not everyone's? I thought everyone's jump arc was the same, and then Charlotte was just a little bit different. But no. It's actually a pretty big variation, actually, from uh, character to character. You know what? I still gotta get reps in, just because, like, I always forget to actually, like, whenever I actually hit this, I never actually do it in match. Still gotta do more of this. Charlie jumps too fast. She's, uh, 42, right? So it's it's noticeable. It's, like, a lot faster than uh, everyone else. I gotta, I gotta do more of this, man. I gotta make this, like, very easy muscle memory in my head. Bonk. So I actually get these raw Urox smashes in the corner. I can send people to hell. I mean, ten thousand damage. That's uh, that's pretty damn good. I mean, you're not gonna you're not gonna catch me complaining about that too much. 
in theory, you could do more with the raw one too. Which, like, it's not that hard to do raw. Like, do, sorry, doing the technical one, rather. Which isn't that hard, considering you're doing it on Wake Up anyway. So it's not like you're, like, doing the, the input under duress or anything, but... Genuinely, my brain can't process that she jumps when she does. Yeah, it's because it's not just that she's faster. It's also, it's it's so sharp, right? Fun fact about that, it actually changes if a character can safely super jump EX, uh, EX slow kill round start. Oh, like their, their jump arc? Hey, look at that, like, like Uno's regular jump, right, is Sora's super jump. Sora stays, when he super jumps, he stays in the air for 48 frames. That's like Uno's regular ass jump. What a, what a time to be alive. What is Uno's super jump? Or, you know, we're waiting. We're, it, it takes a while to find uh, matches in S++. We're, we're waiting around, but we're having fun in the meantime. We're discovering some stuff. What's, uh, if I get Mr. Pringles Man back on here, what does this shit look like? 53, yeah. Oh, you know, who has, uh, it's, it's, is it Grimnir who has, like, the floatiest one? Because that's, like, that's, like, Grimnir's normal jump, no? It's, like, 53? 52, yeah. So his super jump is, oh, wait, his super, Really? Grimnir's super jump barely makes a difference in how long he stays in the air. It goes from 52 to 53. How interesting. Yeah, but Grimnir's jump is floaty as L, right? This dude is so easy to anti-air, but the, but luckily, they gave him the seals so that it's the, you know, it's the exact thought. It's actually, like, incredibly hard to anti-air. Because when he's in the air, he's doing, he's doing, you know, whatever this nonsense is, right? But. Can Sora's ultra skill clothesline go through low projectiles as well, by the way? Yeah, it has armor on the whole thing, right? His, uh, his 66H doesn't have armor on against lows, but... Here begins fate's episode. Seals have more priority than Dive Kick? Yeah. I, 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 apparently, Dive Kick is level 1 attack level, which I did not know. Matera? Hello, Benny. Okay, so we gotta be a little patient in this matchup, but, like, you can't punish throw whiff without Seals? Yeah. Because his, his, his jump is so goddamn float. Kind of afraid to deal with him as Matera? Yeah, he's, uh, I think it's a good matchup for Soros, for sure. But I have to be a little bit careful to not just, like, the one way I lose this is doing too many U dash punches, right? Like, just, like, trying to be a little too impatient, trying to skip neutral a little bit too much. But this, maybe we can, yeah, we also just, like, build up stacks in the neutral, right? Just with the, with the, with the, the guns over time, too. That whiffs on crouchers? How did I, I don't think I knew that. Or if I did, I don't think I remembered that. How interesting. Nope, unfortunately for you, Mr. Matera. We both did- Oh, what? Close H whiffed. We both did our big stupid ultimate skills, but mine is super armored and kills you, and yours, unfortunately, does not uh, share the same distinction. But that that, that U-dash punch, that one's unnecessary. I shouldn't have, I didn't get punished for it, but I very easily could have. And I probably, if you are if you are of the a, a prescri a prescriptive nature, that is, I probably should have gotten punished for it too. But we, don't, we, don't, we don't prescribe around here, we just describe. Oh, nice. Yeah, that, that does get me off, and that's a pretty nice bait that Matera has access to. Well, this is awful. I'm not gonna lie to you. This is this is truly horrendous. Oh, and that's why. Yep, yep. I was worried about getting clipped out potentially, and I just dashed a little bit too much. Didn't spot that. Y'all react to jumps? I, I I feel like I'm okay at it every now and then, when 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 God blesses me on this on this day. Okay, I'll take a break point off you. Yeah. Oh, goddamn. Okay, so they're do they're doing that quite often. I gotta be a little bit. It also like I knew it caught brave counters and throws. I didn't realize it caught two L's so consistently either. Oh, I gotta be uh, yeah, I gotta be roundhouse kicking her out of this too. I can't let her just be getting away with that for free. We gotta be doing the like the heavy DP. It's not invincible, but it's fast. I can also kill her with you dash punch for that. Lots of lots of stuff. I'm being a little sloppy about right now. Oh, nice. What? That was definitely not real. I I, I should have killed her because doing the rain of arrows at that time. I'm getting frame trapped. Somebody help me, Mom. If I did it again. Okay, okay. Fair enough. Trying to be a little too cute with it, I suppose. That's on me. Oh, no! Okay, they, they were sick and tired of my shit. Gotcha. That's my bad. We're still alive, but so that's quite, quite a bit of damage I would rather not take. You predict jumps? That's, like, more difficult, man. In many ways. Many people are saying this. Oh, I got loads. Nice, nice, nice. Good stuff. I kind of, I kind of got beat by Matera's offense. Funny enough, right? I just kept getting beaten by that, uh, that throwback, and, uh, and like the, the little hoppins. Not normally how it goes, but that is how it went right there, for sure. I'll take that. It's a pretty nice gap closer, even if I don't get like, yeah, even if I don't like hit them. I'm still just like close. Ooh, I always forget she has that the six six M there. I just like launch her at you overhead. Okay, DP, understandable. Hmm. So true, bestie. 
Oh, nice spot dodge. I oh, wasn't actually punished. Interesting. Could have been a little bit more patient. Bonk. Uh, bonk. Bonk. Fade and bite. Understandable. Okay. Okay. I didn't get to throw baited, but oh, that that just like whiffs though. If you're not hitting a button, interesting. You can probably punish her for that straight up, huh? Uh, I think I land in time to block this. Yeah. Oh, but I don't have breaking strikes. Not like this. Oh, that's horrible news. That's horrible news. Nice, nice. I tried to uh, far H and then raging strike. What I should have done is far H and then dash punch, but I was autopiloting, so I uh, I didn't realize I had no brave points. But that was very dumb by me. That was straight up a kill right there. Nice. Bonk. She's still pretty minus right there. She hit me so early on in that air-to-air -air situation, right? That's minus seven. I'm not sure if Matera has a button that can punish that, like, easily, but... Oh, DP. Nice, nice. I was trying to rock smash her ass once again. What the hell? Those cla- I guess they're both mediums. Yeah, I guess I shouldn't be that surprised. They are both mediums. But so I, 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 so I just thought that hers would be heavier, honestly. It looks... Like, he puts more more uh, English into it, you know? Bonk. Whoa! Okay. Didn't expect to get a conversion off that, but, you know, we, we move or whatever. That was highly unfortunate. I imagine not what she meant to do. Oh, I dropped the close H. How unfortunate. Okay. Cool. What the? Uh, uh, huh? What? Oh, I, didn't, I, I thought the close H would connect. Wait, what? Is that... Is Rock Smash projectile involved? Why did her DP lose there? Dude, I'm, 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 see I'm seeing some... Oh, nice. I didn't think that that would actually be real there. I was like, they made a mistake, and I didn't capitalize on it in time, and I'm dead. But wait, why did her DP lose there? Huh? I guess Rock Smash is a projectile? But they, it shouldn't... Cl it clashed? I guess. Yeah, the explosions must be projectiles. That was... There were a couple of very weird things, and then they did the they did the uh, the, little, the heavy like rain of arrows too, which I didn't like expect them to do because it was very unsafe, right? But I didn't react in time, and I got uh, beaten up by it. Rock Smash had more hits. I, I guess yeah. Does is but is Crush not a thing for projectiles? I guess because they were both U skills, right? Because I, I would think there'd be like a priority system for projectiles, but I guess because they're both U skill projectiles, there's not like yeah, it being like a a DP projectile doesn't give it like extra. That was very strange. Oh, Seika again. Hello, Seika. That was a... I, yeah, I was not ready for that interaction. I, I also had a couple of close ages that I was I was certain would have hit there. Missed. I'm not sure if it's like a... a if, I, if my timing is that bad or if they just like don't combo when I thought they did or what. But. What the hell? Hello, Seika. Nice to, nice of you to join me in the corner. Yeah, like close age right there too. I, I guess I'm like trusting close age a lot more from Sores than I should. Oh, nice little shimmy. Yeah, I guess I'm trusting close H way too much, because like I keep I keep thinking it's gonna combo in certain spots, and I I keep getting I lost that sets the Matera off of like that in a lot of cases, basically. Oh, you know what? Actually it was safe there. I tried to brave counter right away though. But yeah, he didn't spot dodge fast enough to actually punish me in that case. Nice. Yeah, you don't wanna you don't wanna spot dodge the light one usually. I mean close H is plus? Yeah, it's, I, it's, I'm just, it's not uh, it's not connecting in combos when I think it when I'm when I'm feeling like it should. I'm like off on my uh, expectations a little bit. Oh right, second hit to the sweep. Silly me. Oh, that wasn't okay. I didn't wait long enough apparently, and that wasn't punishable. Is that shit minus eight? I could have sworn I could have two M that. I guess I missed the window, huh? That must be the uh, the explanation there. I just missed the window. Bonk. That, uh, I, I thought I checked that that little, uh, that little thingy is, uh, that little, uh, follow-up there from the parry. I could have killed him for that. Instead, I just decided not to, I suppose, but it's fine. 2M got my back if nobody else got my back. I didn't expect the Arvis to just go clean over my head like that, to be fair. I may not be able to 2H jumps, but I can 2H empty hand pretty well. That's exactly trauma. That sounds right to me. Ow, ow, ow. 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 That shit's minus eight, no? I guess I'm, I must be missing the, the timing on it. Oh, okay. I'll take that. Honestly, spending 50 meter like that is uh, relatively okay with me in this context. Oh, close L. Nice. Yeah, close L will beat out Rock Smash. I guess I got to do a little bit uh, of run up 2L on Seika every now and then. As an Oki option to put the fear of God in him a little bit. 
Oh, nice. I didn't think that was... Oh, it's a seven frame sweep. Right, right. I've died more to jump than H empty hands? And roll even more than both? You've died to roll more than H empty hands? It's like nobody rolls. Ow, ow, ow. Yeah, I guess that's a very good way to answer uh, dash points from so far away, right? I gotta be a little bit more careful about that. Really? I guess, yeah, it's probably a 7 frame 2M versus my, like, if I did it perfectly, my 8 frame uh, 6 6 0. So I suppose that makes sense. Oh, no! I didn't think he would cross me up. Nice, nice, nice. Good stuff. Ow, 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 ow. Somebody help, dude. Ow. I can't take one more of those, so that's a problem. He's hitting a button, I think. No, no, he spot thought. I saw the startup of something from Zeta right there, but nope. Unfortunately not. I don't think that was, maybe, maybe it was a jab and it was a safe jab, but I don't think so. I think that was pretty, pretty late in. I think he just wasn't doing anything. I think I misread it. When he just whiffs a projectile, he's so minus, it's not even funny, I suppose. Yeah. Again, I really got to stop doing that. <laughs> that's a very silly option against uh, the parry in that way. Nice. Oh, really? I couldn't mash out of that. Interesting. I got no escapes by the throw there. Oh, nice. Again, 50 meter. I'll take that in some ways. Counter. Okay. I thought I was going to do a... I kind of like hard read him doing the second one, which he didn't do. Which would have been a punish. But I guess he just hit a button and he was minus enough that it was a counter. Interesting. Oh, <laughs> okay, okay. Again, I, the same thing, but I wasn't rewarded for my uh, silliness this time. I'm dead, by the way. Yeah, good convert. Ooh, I'm not dead. Insane. Good conversion from Seika, still, though. Even though I'm somehow alive. Oh, yeah, it's three separate inputs, right? So it counts. I was like, I can block all this and punish him, but nope, nope, he knows, of course. He would know better than me. When specials are, like, separate inputs each like that, they do count as uh, different hits for Chip. I forgot about that temporarily there. Oh. I tried to not hit a button there to try and bait out a 2H, but I was still too close, I suppose. Get back thrown there. All right, that loses to that. Right, I always forget about that. That happened last time, too, and I found it a very surprising interaction. This is not a, a useful expenditure of a Brave Point right here, but you know what? I guess, I guess I'm stuck with what I've got. Not punishable, huh? Fair enough. Bonk. 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 Every time Coleman hits me as bubs, I cry because my supers function like supers? I, I hope so. It'd be, it'd be kind of unfortunate if they didn't, I would say. L, M, and H, Flamek have 45 to 56 frames of recovery. That is a, it's a little much, for sure. It's kind of insane. It's kind of nuts. No doubt about it. Oh, you got clipped by that. I was not ready to convert that, unfortunately. I was just thinking of that as a pressure option. Nice, 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 nice. Ow. Oh, the conversions go kind of crazy next to the corner carry. It goes kind of insane. Oh, he brave countered the brave counter too early. So true. And this time, Seika, I will not mess up my rating strike combo. I'll keep it nice and simple so even my dumbass can't get it wrong. We'll just do close H. My parry? My parry. It, 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 do, it do be like that sometimes, unfortunately. Sometimes the game says, uh, no. I reacted? Well. Sometimes the game be like, I disagree. Good games, though. I gotta stop using close H as much in combos, I suppose, though. Yeah, I keep, I keep, I keep dropping uh, combos that utilize. Like, I keep thinking, like, oh, I'll have enough time to catch him with a close H here, and I never do. Several times throughout the sets with uh, Matera, and, and like once or twice at least with Seiko. But when are we getting Swords installed? Never. I don't know, man. I feel like I just don't find a time for it, ever. Like, even when I have the 100 meter and I'm under S and I'm at SBA health, I'm like, oh, SSBA health, rather, I'm just like, I don't know, man. Like, I don't wanna drop this combo or, like, waste a Soki or something. Probably, probably could still use it a little more often. Though. We'll see. Maybe, maybe I'll find an opportunity to use it here. Thoughts? It could happen. It could happen to you. Interesting. I didn't think I would recover in time to be safe there. Honestly, I thought that Seika had me cooked. Oh, nice reaction. Yo, the auto mod got another bot. Good job, auto mod. You're learning. Better not count me out. Nice. The thing that pisses me off is that most of Eustace uh, 214 LH and MH is on what? only the first hit is error unblockable. Wait, which one's that? What's 214 on Eustace? Oh, god damn. Nice. Nice. That is a quick ass sweep, and I'm not giving it the respect that it deserves. What? 2L, 2L? Was it? Is this 2L? Wait, how? Is, is, is Swords 2L like minus on block, and I just like didn't know until now? For real? 
Like, or like, really minus on block or something? Nice. Uh, should be able to just kill you here. Yep, yep. The command dash? Oh. Only the first hit is air unblockable of some of the follow-ups. Interesting. Nice. Get grabbed, nerd. Get grabbed, also. Okay, brave counter is understandable. Have a nice day. Oh, no. Nice, nice. Yeah, no, uh, that, with, the, with the U parry, no, uh, no doing anything about that. We're just screwed there. High, low. I'm getting auto combo mixed. Somebody help. Uh, I was not ready to convert that. Not at all. Uh, that's for sure. That's for damn sure. I can't kill you for this, can I? I'm gonna try, but I don't... Yeah, I don't think so. Yeah, no. Not my best expenditure of my resources either, honestly, but... Luckily, we can just wait out that parry and kick you in the face. Not bad, not bad. Alright, hold on a second here. Oh, okay. Not my favorite trade, but I suppose we'll take it. Oh, nice. I've been back throwing him a lot then in that case, so he did meeting me that time. Good stuff. Brave counter, I'll take that, for sure. It's a totally worthwhile trade of resources in my eyes. My turn. Brave counter. Out. Out. I definitely meant to do wake up super there, by the way. A uh, very funny little uh, misinput that maybe kept me alive, actually. Oh, the shimmies. Good stuff. Nice, nice, nice. He did that walk back a couple of times, and this time I was like, you know what? I'll, I'll hit him for it, and he uh, switched it up accordingly. Solid stuff, solid stuff. The uppercut follow up the first hit is so close to the ground that it's useless as an anti-air tool. Interesting. Get thrown, nerd. Oh, nice. Oh, okay. Didn't quite, wasn't quite still in recovery for me to try and punish there, but it's fine. Oh, okay. Yeah, yeah. Fair enough. You're not Matera. Your U reversal will actually work in that circumstance. Oh, okay. We, we, we clipped him. Not really anything material. We clipped him a little bit. I'll take it. And luckily, we can just run up low him like that with 2L. A privilege that Ladiva doesn't have, but Sora's certainly does. Little little run up low check there. I do gotta check how uh, minus Sora's 2L is on block right there, because I feel like I got like blown up for mashing my own shit earlier. Oh, damn. Nice 2M. Clean me out. Okay. Oh, I tried to jump out of the second hit, but it jails. Makes sense. It'd be a pretty bad sweep if it didn't, I guess. Oh, good bait. God damn. Switching that, he has not done that just yet. But he just, he, yep, he tried it and it did work. Bliss sucks. I tell you, what? Okay. This is still a lot of resource I'm contributing to this, but I just kind of wanted the hell out of dodge. Oh my god, Seika, what are you trying to do to me? Bro's trying to kill me for real, for real. I can't take it anymore. Get thrown, get please. Oh my lord, the raging strike. Bro scared the shit out of me, but luckily, I actually was able to, to react in time for once. Holy shit. Like, that was a full reaction. I was not ready for that at all. I tried to catch the jump landing. Oh, okay, that makes sense. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I was not, like, I was, that, I, that was, like, there's, like, a good five frames where my brain was, like, what the hell is going on? But I, I see, I see it. Makes, makes sense. Okay, okay. Well, uh, oh, real quick, before we, I'm gonna, I'm gonna finish this first video here, I think. But real quick, I do want to check something. If I get good old Grimnir to block this. Hello, hold on, I can't see your name, it's too blue. Oh, it's SoCal, hello, SoCal. How's it going? How, how minus this? You changed your Twitch name, I see? Oh, that's been, yeah, it's been the case for uh, a little bit. Wait, blocks, I said blocks all. Why, why he no block all? Oh, because uh, you need, like, crouching or whatever? Yeah, yeah there you go. Please, please stop counter-attacking there, Mr. Grimnir. No, not random. Nothing. This is... Minus two. Oh, okay. So, yeah, I did... Because I did... Well, yeah, cause I did I did 2L, 2L, and I got counter-hit by uh, Seika mashing out of it, and I guess that's why, right? <laughs> Though, this should be a cancel, right, to an extent? So, I guess I, I just, like... I guess I linked this accidentally, and that's why I got mashed. But you can, like... Can, you can, like... Yeah, you can, do, you can go faster than normal, right? You can cancel your recovery there. Come. Where, yeah, 10 frames of recovery, you can just go right away after two. But I guess I, I went to 2L. My 2L is, uh, is minus 2, all of them are to my knowledge. Yeah, but like, what I was thinking of more so, Seika, is that like, you can, because you can like, you can cancel it like this, and then it won't be, it'll be gapless, right? 
But yeah, I like staggered it, and that's why I uh, that's why I got mashed out on pretty much. If you do this, this could probably like if I even have Grimnir sets to counter attack, I don't think he's gonna get like a chance, right? I'm pretty sure this is gapless. Yeah, exactly. So that's why I was confused. I think I intended to do this, and I ended up with this. Yeah, exactly. I ended up doing like two L stagger, two L, and I got blown up. Cool, interesting. Well, for now, that is gonna do it for this first Swords video. Here we're gonna play one more, and we'll play some Geef, but. Uh, besides that, as always, YouTube, you know how it is. Any kind of like, subscribes, comments, bells, all greatly appreciated on these sorts of things. It helps a lot with the algorithm, helps a lot with the human being right here, too, so I can know if you guys like this or not. I also have a, uh, Discord. You can join if you want. It's a nice place. Link in the description there. It's a good place to learn about fighting games, but also a nice place to, you know, just make some friends. Seika's in there. You can hang out with him if you, if you so choose. You can, you can teach us some stuff about, uh, Nier and Zeta. Also, also, install labbing? Hell no, I just like doing it because the animation looks cool. I stream every day from uh, 5 p.m. to 9 p.m. Eastern, except for Fridays. If you want to come by and hang out, I also would encourage you to do so. Most importantly, hope you guys had a great time hanging out. As always, you know, I sure did. You know, we're, uh, we're, we're in S++. It's happened. I think we're playing okay. I think the Matera set was, uh, there was a lot of spaghetti, a lot of, like, technical drops on my part. Not so much, uh, you know, not so much in the decision-making department. Just, like, a lot of uh, a lot of technical rust. Or not rust, but just, like, technical silliness, I suppose. But, yeah, overall, so happy with what we're playing. And uh, we'll keep keeping on with the stories here until we finally, hopefully, get to master. For now, though, have a lot of fun with Diaper Grandpa. There's going to be a lot more coming your way, and until then, I will see you in the next one. Peace.